located between dense forest and one of the Great Lakes. This quaint small town is littered with B&Bs and hotels for the seasonal visitors who come to take in the natural beauty of the area. One of the B&Bs in the downtown was operated by a Croatian family. But now without any information or leads on why, sits abandoned and decaying. First thing we see is this gorgeous old couch. It's white and surprisingly still white considering it's in an abandoned place. Very old lamp beside it. Painting of a deer or moose. So many old nice features in here. Old photo album. And look at this photo. Holy. Let's see what it says. There's no date. Look at that. That is nice and old. No way. Is that what I think it is? That's an old projector. Freaking cool. Another very, very old picture. Nothing on the back. The old map. Just so much stuff left behind in here. Oh, the kitchen's in rough shape. A lot of stuff knocked over. Let's see if I can get around from the other side. Very old. Everything left behind. All the food, everything. The calendar is 2006. Ceilings starting to give way and cave in. We've got a side door and the way down to the basement. All oh, the bottom of the stairs are caved in. Oh, don't like the sounds of that. Let's see if I can do this. Oh, it stinks pretty awful down here. Cool. There's a lot of mold. That's for sure. What the heck is that? It's a moldy, like, tiki face. Okay, there's lots around in here. Obviously the laundry room, furnace, this is a rifle cleaning kit. I wonder if there's guns left behind in here.
gonna have to keep my eyes open there might be okay in a very moldy washroom I'm not gonna bother going inside of there is this another gun cleaning set no that's a measuring Oh, this is moldy and bad. I really don't like not going into rooms. But this is bad. There's a shelf full of moldy books. Would you look at that? Is that an actual musket? Or is that just a decoration piece? I think it's just a decoration piece. Yeah, it is. I saw the gun cleaning kit and I thought maybe. But that's just a decora decoration. There's another one on this side. Oh yeah, it's bad down here. I'm getting out of here. I'm gonna go upstairs. This is the front door. Guess that's their no vacancy sign. Very decorative everywhere in here. Oh, and my little pony. Fully intact room with two beds. Looks like all the rooms are intact. Well, to a degree, they're full of stuff. Look at the TV, an old Zenith floor model. It's a map of Croatia. cabinet whoa what is all this Another painting with deer. Oh my. Nazi insignia. Okay. I was kind of, yeah, and there's a German flag there. I wasn't sure. How do I get this back open now? Okay. 
but I was pretty sure that these symbols on these suspenders were German as well. The Iron Cross. What in the heck? There's the old pipes. Look at this old hat. Wow. I want to check out this book a little bit more. Wow. Yo guys. Yo. That is interesting. Look at the colors in this bathroom. That's still a dress hanging on the door with a purse. No bed set up, but the mattresses are leaned up against the wall. Chandelier. More dresses. Even this, this is like straight out of the 60s. I love that. Yeah, so right? Cool. And look at the old iron. There used to be an iron board too. Charles. I can't read that. Charles Craft. Oh, the ironing board there? This used to be like right here, yeah. Again, German writing. Mm. Well, look at this room. No smoking in here. Okay. More Nazi <clears throat> stuff. Yeah, I've seen that. Okay, wait till you're in the other room. Why? There's it? more. Yeah? Yeah. It's got a radio handbook over there. I don't know what that means. Is that like those like Morse code books or no? No, it'd be like radio. That's what I radio, thought. No. But... Radio communication, say like back in the day. Yeah. Like yeah. where you do codes and stuff. Yeah, probably. I actually wouldn't mind taking that book up just to look at it on the video. What is this thing? It's like a radio slash compass. Cool. Zenith Trans Oceanic. Is this a ham radio? It might be. I don't know. Okay, Russian military power, Waffen SS. Mercenary Soldier of Fortune. The living races of mankind. The standard library of natural history. The unknown war. The armed forces of World War II. A lot of military books. Old typewriters. Tons of VHSs. I don't know 
what any of them are. Wow. Very old computer. A little closet full of clothes and ties. Is this a fridge? It is, but it has a lock. Another closet full of old clothes. A fur coat. So the way to the third floor is through here, right? Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's a whole other... Where? Yeah, I'll show you. So did you see all this in here? Oh my god. They were telling me there's a third floor here, and... I looked at that and I didn't even realize that was a door. It's going upstairs. Oh, wow. oh, it's a tight squeeze. Oh, this is another room. There's an ensuite bathroom. It's almost like a loft suite. What is this thing? Is this part of an old hair dryer? Ronson Escort. Dry nails. Maybe it's something to do with nails? Old typewriter. Wow. What an interesting place. What are these? These are all blueprints. Don't know what they're for. Oh, look at the old scale. I wonder if it still works. No, I don't think so. <laughs> this is awesome. Wow. What an interesting place. What an extremely interesting uh, bed and breakfast. Can't believe so much is left behind and all of those military books and the German and Nazi books and memorabilia. Very, very, very interesting. Let me know what you guys found interesting. If you saw anything that I missed, I'll see you all in the next adventure.